six acres outdoors today since the weather is getting warm um, I'm starting to get the fishing bug so today we're gonna melt some lead sinkers make our own uh, what I'm using I'll show you how I use it actually it says it's made in voyage so um, this is what we're working with we've got the Lee Lee Pro um, lead melt and pot I'm gonna plug it in heat it up we're gonna set it up uh, from what I the research I done for bank sinkers about five or six and I got my gloves I've got my do it right do right do it mold it's our three ounce sinker one we make four at a clip and that's what I that's what we normally use uh, to do a lot of fishing in the river for striper and porgy and all that other blackfish and fl uh, flounder whatever whatever is in there it's close to me so I don't really go out too far so a three ounce um, bank sinker works out rather well and then we got our tray to knock them off on some blocks underneath it keep the heat out and now there's two kinds of lead that I have I've got cleaner lead or clean lead. It's fairly clean it's uh, like a lead flash that was a new roll I picked it up somewhere so we're gonna use that and then because if, if I wanted to use dirty lead which I can get tons of because I do plumbing work and I'll take cast iron pipe and I'll smack out all the lead but if this was the case we're using this maybe I'll have time for a video today about that we would melt it down skim off all the swag and then we put it in muffin tins and make clean ignots lead ignots so let me fire this bad girl up see what we can do and get to making some sinkers all right and of course now it's starting to sprinkle outside so I had to drag in our our little functioning workstation out of the rain because you last thing you want is water hitting your hot lead it'll go all over the place and you don't want to get hurt so make sure you have your gloves and whatnot and uh starting to heat up burn off all that factory oil and like i said the three ounce sinkers a package of three of them in my area last summer was almost five bucks i'm sure now i'm sure now with everything going on they're you know five six bucks for three of them so if you can score your lead for free have a buddy that has a pot or go buy one i think this pot was 110 dollars and this is the larger of the two is supposed to do it that believe 20 pounds or 15 pounds. i don't know the box is over there i bought it last year and didn't use it so give it a whirl okay she is melting down nice nice and quick that was all the clean lead i had not a whole lot but we're gonna let that finish up and then we'll scoop out all that swag, throw it on our tin foil, and then hopefully we'll let left with some nice clean lead. Once it's melt down, my buddy Dave, Uncle Dave's coming over. He's bringing some more clean lead, and uh, we'll see what we get. All right, she has definitely melted down rather quickly now. I'll turn it down a little bit. I had to turn it up. A scotch. So let's get uh, all the nastiness out of there as much as we can. over there you want to see nice with some oil in that get a lot of slag so we don't want a lot of that in there because it'll clog the pore hole giant ass glove. It's going to kind of weasel around. Whoops. And this stuff is boiling hot. You all know me. I'm too impatient. I think I'm ready to pour some. All right, we got our mold. We're just gonna stick it underneath the pour hole. We're gonna just lift the handle right till it comes up to the top. Oop. Nice smooth stream. I'm old, rusty. The one thing I forgot to do was heat my mold. 
they may not want to come out too well. Let's see. Oh, look at that. I probably should have let it. Got some nice, uh, then we can, we can snap the rest of that lead off and put it back in a pot. I just over poured a little bit. And if my mold was hot, they'd pop out. Oh well. We got the idea, look at that. And they are lava hot, so <clears throat> don't, uh, there we go. So I'll heat the mold up for the next batch. And then uh, there they are, three ounces, good to go. There's $5 from Walmart right there, three of them. And we'll snap, I'll just snap those off, put them back in the pot. All right, so the second batch, I'm gonna heat up. Just with the regular propane torch. Just heat your mold up a little bit. They'll pop out easier. And try not to over pour like I did. All right, we are burning this stuff away. We're even using the uh, the older, dirty stuff and just scrape, scraping out all the all the slag. And uh, we got some. We are definitely in business. So we got a little bit more to burn for today. Meltdown, and we'll, uh, we'll show you what we got when we're done. All right, we made some serious lead today. We melted everything we had. And then the uh, another tip is leave some lead in your pot. Because um, you don't want to clog that the drain thing where you uh, pour it into your mold. Worked out great. We got, we made, did make some larger ones, some 10 ounce ones, but we got a pile of three ounce uh, bank sinkers um, and some leftover crap. So I hope you guys like that. If you have any questions, please uh, comment, like, subscribe. Thanks for watching. And uh, we'll do some more, uh, making some different molds. I'm gonna order some different ones tonight for jig heads and some different size sinkers. And we'll do some more videos on this. It's a lot of fun. All right, thanks for watching. Catch you next time.